okay, we're going to drain the hydraulic oil out of these angle rams, flush them, and put new fluid in. It's pretty simple. Um, I put up instructions on uh, snowplowingcontractors.com. Let's do a little video here and see if that makes it even easier for people to understand how to do it. Uh, I got a jug, spare coupler, an old hose cut off on one end, the coupler half on the other. These two ends happen to match the two ends that are on this plow. tops of the ramps. And that'll let any fluid drain that's in the hoses. I need this again now when I go with the flush. But I just want you guys to see what comes out. Using a clear jug like this, you can see what you got. And this fluid doesn't look that bad. Uh, this plow is actually purchased uh, from a used car dealer. On a Jeep YJ. And they just want to be sure everything's going to work properly this winter, so they brought it by for service. So, we're going to do just that. I'm going to go get the uh, bottom of flush, and we'll show you how to flush the ramps. flush here. This one happens to be a Meyer Hydra flush. Real handy. This whole process can be a little messy, but if you're careful, usually it's not too bad. What I'm doing is I'm cleaning off the end of this hose because I'm going to stick in that bottle of flush. This is the cylinder that's collapsed. It's fully closed. Like I said, it's going to be a messy process. So 
Sometimes you can just pierce this right there with the hose. Yep. Get that all the way down into the bottom. This is where it gets a little tricky. And now as I push this this way, I'm going to be drawing flush into this other one. This cylinder, normally we pop this off, and then we couple these two together. One of the reasons this plow came to us in addition to having a ram flush is that the previous owner install the male coupler half on this angle ram and the male coupler half on the end of that hose so they cannot be coupled together we're going to change that while it's here today so as long as this one's full I'm just going to let it sit full of the flush and I'm going to go get the proper end to put on here 